Greetings everyone. Welcome back at my favorite beach. I'm up on the uh, big rock pile, if you will, that leads down to the beach. And uh, got a few beauties already down here. I'm going to pick up uh, and get this thing started. And first of all, There's a nice galaxy stone, nice uh, red vein to it. I'm going to put it right over there on the street so I can pick it up on the way back. Here's another one. It's got some color to it, but the shape is kind of lousy, so I'm going to leave it here for somebody else. Anyway, uh, the search is on. We're looking for uh, amcadoidal basalt and uh, Ones we call dragon blood stones. Anyway, it's a uh, cool and windy day, but not bad for the day before Thanksgiving 2024, which would make it November 27th. And uh, we're off and running. All right, the search goes on. Yeah, and we see that one, and uh, it's a good size to bring home, and uh, it should clean up pretty well. Really want to find that dragon blood stone, though, but uh, we'll keep looking. It's a beautiful day once you get down below the wind. Look at that baby. Yeah, if that was epitote or jasper or red, red anything, that might be a beauty. But uh, that'll stay there. But the uh, the nice cover of stones today. I'll keep you posted. Yeah, don't put peak yet. Yeah, a little bit of a jasper, I guess. All right, the search continues. All right, it's been a while since I uh, found anything good. I did find this piece of basalt, but, you know, there's a nice one with some uh, dragon blood on the side. Kind of a, a dull one, but uh, we'll take it home and see what it turns into. Another little one. But we're looking for reds. All right, the search continues. bad but too small. <coughs> Some epidote. A little bit of feldspar in there. Alright, the search continues. Looks like M. Godoidal brick type to me. All right, we're here by the water. Tides on the way out, though. I don't have to get too worried. All right, search continues. Nice conglomerate. Uh, a little bit too many dents in it for me to take it home, but uh, that's a pretty one. It would look nice, but uh, it would take a long time, and I don't know if I have a long time. Anyway, 
We're looking for our uh, dragon blood stones. And uh, usually I find something close every time, but uh, we'll see. Sorry about the wind. There's another interesting one I just stumbled across. Uh, I think that's going to go home. It's a big one, but I'm going to bring it home. Didn't even get uh, two feet. And I got this sort of uh, whatever it is. But uh, I think that's going to polish up pretty nice. Alright, you find a few good things. What is that? Looks like iron staining to me. Alright, the stretch continues. That could be a piece of this uh, ocean jasper or whatever it is. I don't know. Oh well, if it is. I don't like the looks of it. Anyway. There's a lot left to look for. Just continues. Very nice stuff. all that stuff. I don't know. You yeah, can't get too far without finding. There's a nice piece of grass saw, a little bit too big in the wrong shape. But still got some nice colors on it. And it would make a nice one if you had the time to take care of it. Road tight. All right, the switch goes on. Another five feet. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Not bad, but not what I'm looking for. All right. What do we got here? I don't know. Only because there's no uh, uh, epidote. I'd like to see a couple of veins of epidote in there also, so. And yeah, we'll leave that one for the next guy. There's a little bit of red in that one. I'm not going to take it home though. I've got so many of them, I'm looking for only really, really, really red ones if I can get them. It'll be there for someone else, hopefully. I picked up this little piece of uh, what you'd say is unikite. And then I turn around. 
it. I pick up this, which is a uh, that's a real piece of unicorn. Anyway, go off to home. There's a gateway to the interior. That's a nice one. Too big. Got some dragon blood in there somewhere. Yeah, maybe I'll take it home. Yeah. Beauty though. All right, the hunt goes on. Uh, one last nice piece. I remembered to pick it up on the way out. I'll uh, get some pictures and uh, show you what I captured today. Anyway, uh, the wife will be by in a minute. Oh, she's at the car now. So I'm just in time. See you next time. All right. This is what we got this morning. Actually, we got them yesterday morning, but uh, without decent sunlight yesterday, um, I wasn't able to film them. But a number of decent rocks there. Galaxy stones. Oh, this one has a little bit of dragon blood in it. Who knows? Gold quartz. Of course, I'm probably all rust staining. And uh, this one here has got a little bit of uh, dragon blood on the outside. And this one, I don't have any idea what that is. But this one has um, some nice blue in there. And once that comes out, you'll see it. Yeah, so let me just go back and wet that one. This one has all the little blue stripes in it and little blue seams or whatever. See how that works out. Uh, whatever this type of rhyolite is, I believe it must be a rhyolite, but it's got so much... Um, character and depth to it, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, this one has a little dragon bloodstone on the top. It's another, uh, probably a granite type. Uh, but it has some nice uh, level bands with the, uh, well, I guess you'd maybe call it epitope, but I don't think so. And we got the uh, unikites that I found. There's a couple of them on the beach. Probably be picking up more of them. And uh, there's a nice conglomerate. Let me turn that one over. It's got some nice color in it. Nice uh, orange and pinks and whatever. Some dark red there. We'll see how it plays out. Another little galaxy stone that has some uh, dragon's blood flying across the sky here. And another piece of, uh, I don't know, could be quartz, could be a lousy uh, agate of sorts. Of, not quality agate is what I'm trying to say. Anyway, a couple of uh, more galaxy stones here to round out the uh, what I found. and. Those are always interesting, and I like the ones with the uh, big green crystals too. Those are nice when they're nice and uh, nice and green. We'll see how those play out. And uh, then we got uh, this one here with little yellow spots on it. We'll see what it goes on with that. Anyway, thanks for stopping by. I hope you enjoy watching this stuff. Uh, never gets boring for me, but uh, it's nice to see all the beautiful colors that you can find in the rocks just down the beach near you.